You know that sweet girl off of Jessie that everyone loved because she was so sweet and innocent? Well, she's not so nice anymore. If you get on her Twitter, it's literally just her exposing people without fact-checking anything. Now I get it, she doesn't like racism, neither do I. She's trying to expose it, but she's gone the complete wrong way about it. For the most part on her Twitter, she's just exposing people and giving out usernames to Instagram and Snapchat, stuff like that. But she has doxxed several people. Now she wouldn't like to admit this, but she has given several phone numbers out of minors who have supposedly said racist stuff in the past. Now it is super easy to fake stuff like that and she's not able to fact check like any of this really. So it's not really her place to be exposing these kids and giving out incorrect phone numbers sometimes and exposing the wrong person. She says she wants to use her platform for good, but she's literally out here ruining lives of innocent college students. Now you may be wondering how they're innocent. Well, it's pretty easy to fake a snap and put something racist on there to make someone look bad. And if you don't believe me, make sure you guys stay tuned because I'm gonna be showing you just how easy it is. Here on my channel, I like to give shoutouts away almost every single video. The winner of our last shoutout was Dark Gamer. If you would like to win a shoutout like him, make sure you guys find this icon somewhere throughout the video wherever I hide it. Whenever you see it pop up, make sure you comment the timestamp down below. And if you're first and don't edit your comment, you'll be the next winner. Anyways, let me give you a quick summary on how Sky Jackson is ruining lives. Basically, she's asking people to send her DMs of their friends being racist, and she'll expose them for you. Now that seems nice and all, but the problem is, people with bad intentions are sending out fake like pictures, fake racist comments, and all that. It's really easy to do. Let me just show you. Alright, so this is literally what people do. They use this little format, they get on Instagram of someone they don't like, um, in my case, I'll take a screenshot of my dog and then we'll crop it. Now we'll make it like the dimensions of like a phone. Now we're going to get on Snapchat. Now once you're on Snapchat, you just add it through camera roll and then you do edit photo and you can literally put the text right on there. In my case, I'm just going to say my dog is silly cute. But yeah, basically what people do is they throw in something racist right there, they make that person look awful, they send it into their college, boom, that person's life is ruined. So if you went through Sky Jackson's Twitter before she got rid of half of the awful things that she posted, you'll see that a lot of the posts are similar to what I just showed you. They're literally just people sending in fake snaps of people saying awful stuff. When in reality, it's just someone who's angry at someone else and they want to ruin their life. And then you have Sky Jackson who wants to use her platform for good, supposedly, out here ruining lives. But like right here, a college is actually responding to someone that she exposed. This one may have been for the better of all of us actually, but there are some in here that are pretty awful. And then we have her right here. If you're sending me anyone's username, please make sure you have it 100% correct. It's not cool to blame someone for something they didn't do. So the problem with this is you're trusting a stranger to not lie to you. There are people with bad intentions out there who would love to expose someone they don't like, and you're giving them a platform to do so. And then she also has a bunch of these tweets where she's saying, sorry I mixed up the username, or sorry I mixed up the phone number of the person that I doxxed. There's stuff like that everywhere. She can't get any of this information right because she's just out here being angry on Twitter, rapidly just exposing everyone without fact checking a thing. So my question to you Sky Jackson is, do you think you're actually helping this situation? Do you think that the people that you're exposing right now are actually gonna come through and stop being racist because of this? No, you're just making them mad. They're gonna go out there and be even worse. I dare you not to expose these people and to instead try and reach out to them and help them. And just explain why you don't think it's acceptable to say these things in a nice matter. You're out here trying to do good, but you're just exposing minors with faulty information. It's literally so backwards. You're 18, you need to figure it out. It's just sad. What can I